Hi everyone, um, I'm back today to film a, another small unboxing. Um, I did one, um, actually did it just a few minutes ago to show you the um, Gucci Ace sneakers that I bought. If you're interested, I did a comparison between two sizes in these to clear up whether they really do come up as big as people say they do. So that will be, I can link that in the description if anyone is interested in that. So I thought I'd give you a quick show of those. And while I was sitting in front of the camera with some makeup on for a change, um, I thought I'd show you uh, the other little unboxing that I have to do. This is an unboxing from Louisa Viaroma. I got them from here because, as you've heard me say in the last couple of videos, this place actually does cashback. Um, if I can find um, a deal that has either a code or some kind of cashback with um, Top Cashback or Quidco, you can bet your bottom dollar that I'm going to go with that one to, just to save a little bit of money. It gives you incentive to buy from that place rather than somewhere else. So this is the lovely box that the shoes came in. This is a pair of shoes. And inside just the invoice and then Louisa Viaroma always tie their um, packages with the bow and it's actually secured to the bottom of the parcel so it doesn't move around too much in transit so there's the Louisa Viaroma ribbon and I will just undo that And I don't know if you can see or colour the boxes, but that's a dead giveaway for what is inside. So here we have Valentino, gorgeous red box. And inside, I'll show you the details in a second. These come with two dust bags for for you to store your shoes in, if you so wish. And there is what's this one? Yeah, just a little care booklet in that envelope. And then another little envelope. And inside here, there are some little spare studs there so these are some rock studs and now I don't do heels I haven't done heels for a very long time um, I think I'm past that now at my age but inside here I have the how do they name these the Valentino Rock Stud PVC Slide Sandals. Now, I'll show you that one quickly, but Louisa Viaroma do send their items with a tag on. The same as a lot of places do. If you remove the tag, then you've bought it. Keep the tag on, you can try your um, items on and then send it back, but you have to leave the tag on. So, let me get out the one that doesn't have a tag so you can see a little better. So, here we go. I love these sandals so much. So, I actually bought these in a size 41. If I show you this. Just the details. Now I bought them in a size 41 because I actually have them in a size 40. Um, I've had these for a year. I have worn them quite a lot, but they rub my feet very slightly at the front here. And I think it's just, <sighs> I'm a big girl and I have very wide feet. <laughs> so I think it's just, I needed the 
extra size to just give me a little bit more room um, in the front there. Um, but yeah, these are my old pair. And if I compare the two, there's like really not much in it at all. Like millimeters. But these bigger ones are quite a lot wider as you can see there so I'm hoping that is going to stop my poor big toe getting ripped to shreds whenever I wear them. I wore these most of last summer until my big toe could take it no longer um, but then even when my toe healed I would still wear them again until my toe got sore so I really did like give these a good running last summer so I knew that if I got another pair that they would get worn so I thought I could also um show you my Gucci slides that I got um two years ago I think um these ones are actually a 39 and these ones come up slightly bigger than the Valentino slides let's see if I can These are the, so this is a six, this one is a seven, or a 39 and a 40. And if I show you, they are pretty much exactly the same. Um, also the Gucci is a lot more um, malleable than the Valentino's. These are quite stiff um, rubber which just means that they hold their shape better but you do have to you know allow for your toes it, you know it because it's harder sometimes this can be um a little uh, less forgiving on your toes these ones are super comfy and i actually want to get another pair of these uh, because these ones kind of look a bit beaten up now yeah these ones are a size six which is the size i usually take and they fit me great the Valentinos, I have a seven, and the new ones are an eight. So it just goes to show you, these, they all come up different, and it's crazy. It'd be so much easier if they were all the same. And I just thought I'd show you these for the hell of it as well. These are just a cheap pair of slides from Shoe. Um, these are also a size 40 or a size seven. And these, if I remember, these ones did come up slightly bigger might help if I showed you the correct shoe so these are the regular ones from shoe they're about the same to be honest so the Gucci and the shoe one are around about the same size maybe a couple of mil millimeters difference um, but I think the shoe one comes up slightly higher um, there's a little bit more room for your toes you see there against the size 40 Valentino and the size 41 just cheap one from shoe they are pretty much identical and the width seems around about the same maybe the one from shoe slightly wider and then this is the size 41 yeah 41 and the shoe 40 so just a couple of millimeters bigger there but I've been wearing my son's adidas slides um, these ones as slippers <laughs> for like the last few months and these are he's got feet that are a lot bigger than me and his are an eight they are slightly too long for me but because they're an eight they're slightly wider um, and they're much more comfortable so that's why I know that these are going to be slightly too long in the foot but I'm just hoping that they fit me um, a little more comfortably than the size sevens do there we are that is my new pair of Valentino rock stud slides from Louisa Via Roma I've shown you the tag I can't see anything there we are sorry I'm losing a bit of sunlight now and they are absolutely gorgeous. Um,
price for these was £220, which is obscene, I know. But I wear them so often I kind of don't mind paying that. And I figured if these ones fit me better than my size 7s, then maybe I can sell the size 7s and get a little bit more money back. But do remember, if you've got top cash back, always check if they are offering top cash back, uh, if they're offering cash back. Because I think with these I got about £10 back on these. You know, we spend a lot of money on them. And if you can get a little bit of cash back, then it kind of sweetens the deal a little bit. Um, I will always buy from a website that is offering cash back over a website that isn't. Um, for example, the Gucci trainers that I just bought, I got them from net porte rather than Gucci, mainly because they were offering, it was only like 3% cash back, but 3% on a pair of shoes that cost £445 is over £10. And I'd rather have that £10 in my pocket than in someone else's pocket. So I would always recommend checking the cashback sites and also check Google for any, um, you know, discount codes in that. Uh, you know, they've got Louisa Via Roma. Um, they quite often have discount codes. Um, My Teresa have discount codes. Then you have the Outnet and Stylebot. You can usually find some kind of code, even if it's free delivery um, for these companies. Um, as I said, these shoes were uh, £220, but I found the code for 10% off, and 10% of that is £22. So that, on top of the cashback, well, you can't grumble at that, to be honest. So I hope that was of some help to you, and I hope you enjoyed seeing my new shoes, and also my old shoes, um, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you, bye. I was just saying, um, yeah, I got, I think it was about £10 back for the um, the Valentino slides. Where are they? Oh, they're on my feet. <laughs>